Hey guys, we know that many of you in the skydiving community have been waiting for us to come up with a wrist-mounted altimeter. Well, today I'm happy to announce that that wait is over, and what we came up with is one of the most unique and useful altimeters ever created for skydiving. Let me give you a rundown of some of the most salient and interesting features of DigiLT. The first and perhaps most obvious feature that sets DigiLT apart from other altimeters is its integration of ColorLT2's patented light technology in a light bar above the LCD. The integration of the light bar enables quicker altitude recognition, as one can recognize light patterns and colors quicker than numbers, especially when a lot of motion is involved. We actually developed the light technology for Color LT2 on DigiLT last year, so you can actually use any kind of alert or effect available on Color LT2 on DigiLT as well. In fact, I like to sync them up when I jump in both. Another feature you'll notice is this high resolution sharp memory LCD that looks just beautiful in bright sunlight. Just like our newest audibles, Soto LT2 and Color LT2, DigiLT logs your jumps for syncing to FDS Logbook. You'll find that although the altimeter itself is quite compact, the numbers are actually similar in size to those on other skydiving altimeters. And additional information such as current preset, climb rate, and date and time can optionally be displayed at the bottom of the LCD during different phases of a skydive. You can also set up to five presets, which can actually be named as well on DigiLT. Although its battery life is going to depend primarily on the use of the LEDs, we're finding that we're getting around three to six weeks of regular jumping before needing to recharge the altimeter. DigiLT comes in a robust nylon case, for which we'll be creating additional mounting options in the future. Now this altimeter has a ton more unique features and we're really excited about it, but for now we're just going to have to leave it at that. For more information or to be one of the first to jump Freefall Data Systems' first numeric altimeter, visit freefalldatasystems.com. Stay safe up there.